Welcome back to the void. I'm player one by myself. And welcome back to Persona. So of course, last time we went through the haunted mansion. We met Maki's mom, um, our Maki, not Maki in the party. And we went back to the real world. We're in Deva Yuga and we're finally gonna confront Kondori once and for all. God complex bastard. But first, you know there's a bad ending in this game, and I've been working towards getting it. And, um, we're here today to, to see that. I have a feeling it's not going to end at all well, seeing as it's how it's the bad ending. So, yes. We are back in the other save file, we're back in the Haunted Mansion. And now we're gonna, um... We're gonna kill Maki's mom. You know, we, we saw all this before, but but now... Now we're actually gonna fight her, we're gonna fight Haridi. Which... If you think about it... How the hell are we going to get to the real world now? Why are you getting in my way? Give me back my daughter! My child, give Maki back! Hey, isn't this really Maki's mom? Here it comes. Oh. Oh, Maki's not even in the fight. Ooh. Well, that's not good. Okay, well, let's just, uh, let's just see how we do. This can't be a hard fight. Seeing as how, you know, you're not even meant to do this fight. So let's just see how it, uh, how it goes. Why did I have animations on? I don't know. There we go. Seems like weak to fire. Oh, okay. D cover. What? What did that do? Hmm. And she is, oh, she is very slow considering how we're getting basically two turns before she goes. Oh, she had a Maudine. Okay, okay. Live, live, live. We need to revive Mark. Mark fucking died. Holy shit. Okay, okay. Um. We're gonna have Reiji do it because he doesn't have a fire move. Okay. All right. And now, I'm gonna do dun dun. Nanjo's gonna heal. Mark's gonna do this, and then bada bing, bada boom. Why are you targeting Mark, you bitch? Stop it. Okay. Now we're back up. And now we should be fine. Alright. What is D cover? What does that do? How are you still alive? Oh, Sonic Bullet. We might run out of SP before she dies. Come 
Come on, Nanjo. Is D covered? Getting rid of SP or something? I don't know. There we go. All right. And we got the level ups. Oh, Nanjo got two. Now, what is going to happen? Child eater. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh. Is she dead? Oh no, she's she's good. This isn't the infirmary. Oh, it's the haunted mansion. I think the dialogue is the same. Yeah, the dialogue is the exact same, even though we beat her ass. <laughs> hmm. Okay, well, well now... Um... That's, that's that bit. So now... I'll meet you back when, when we get back to Deva Yuga. Who the hell is talking in my ear? Anyway, we're back. So here we are, Deva Yuga. Going to explore this place, get all the stuff, so I am prepared for the big boss. So we're on the second floor from the elevator, and there's only one thing we can get here. Can't even go anywhere else on this floor. Um, we can only go to this one room over here. What the? What the? Oh, it's Incubus. With his... <laughs> Donger. Indeed. Die. He absorbs fire. He absorbs magic of all kinds. God damn it. Okay, how about gun? There you go. You know, Incubus is usually like a, like a beginning, beginning shadow, so don't know why he's late game here. Also, good to know he kept, he kept that part of his design all, all throughout. Big old, big old hog. Alright. This, three boxes, nice. Four muscle drinks. Okay. Two chewing souls. And a repulse bell. What is a muscle drink? Okay. So you need just your, just your little your your cool little items there that we don't really need because we have good spells. I wonder when they make the Persona 1 remake if they're going to keep all of these guys or if they're just going to replace them with, you know, the modern Shadows personas. I do wonder. I do wonder how those Persona 1, Persona 2 remakes are going to work anyway since the games are very different than the modern ones. Because, I don't know if you've noticed, um, we've just been going straight this whole game. There has been no calendar at all. This has been basically one day, if you don't count the, the, the moon cycles up there. This was all one day. What the hell is that, little Cupid? Cupid? 
in some type of warrior man. <laughs> Alright. If you look at the item, we've got the long gynus. Whatever the hell that is. What? What is that? I think it's a equipment. The long the long gynus. It's a spear. Who uses a spear? Ooh. It don't matter, we still got our, our shit from the casino all that time ago, and it has still not been usurped. Okay. So now, where am I going? Who is talking? Why would you have that in your OST? Ooh. Ooh? And they absorb magic. Oh wait, no, they just absorb fire. Everything else is fine. Oh yes, there we are. And let's level up for Maki. Okay, um, we go this way. Oh, these fools again, they're dying. Mm-hmm. All right, keep going. We got the stairs right there. Is there anything else? No. No, we just go straight to the stairs. Back to the second floor. Okay. And we're just going for more stairs. Alright, we got Robocop. Most of this game has just boiled down to use guns. And if you can't use guns, then use your, your super spells, because SP just naturally recovers. I can definitely see how in some aspects this game is harder than the modern ones, but personally to me, this is, this is easier. You just kind of turn your brain off. Okay. Go this way. No. No. And I feel like we're still like oh, I feel like we're still mostly all right for this level of the game. You know, we haven't changed personas in so long, but I just have not felt the need to. No, God. Okay. More stairs. Back to the first floor. Oh, good. Die. Uh huh. Okay. Now, what is here? Well, there is a save point. Which is pretty good. God damn it. <laughs> I love when they don't even get a chance. 
Alright, save point. As soon as I get this bad ending, this save file is going in the garbage. Because I will not need it. Okay. So now... Now we gotta traverse the whole the whole damn place, because the next stairs are on the other side. Good. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna meet you when we get to the stairs. Alright. Back to the second floor. And there is another save point. God damn it. No, I don't, I don't really care for the dungeon design in this game. It's, it's a, just a lot of walking. A lot of walking. Not interesting walking, either. You go up and down stairs, and up and down more stairs, to get to even more stairs, to then get to the boss. It, it's just, it, I did it. Ugh. Because I feel like, you know, this place, Deva Yuga, would be very cool to walk around. But it, it, it's, it's not that cool to walk around. Okay, so now we have to go to the other side to get to more stairs. Huh. We got another long Hmm. Okay. Then we go up there. What? Reiji? Reiji, why? So we go up here, more stairs, back on the third floor, and now... But to tell you the truth, what are you saying? What are you saying, random lady? Okay. We... Oh, would you look at that? There's a room. And then more stairs. Okay. <sighs> Can we all agree that visible enemies on the map is infinitely times better than um, random encounters? We can all agree that, right? Because <laughs> it's true. It is very, it is very much true. Oh. At least people are getting a few levels. That's nice. Okay. Do 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 do. Ba ba boo. Ba ba pee 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 boo. And here's the room. What is in it? Some... some men. Some men? 
Nice. Strength incense. Black tablet. Black tablet. I believe that's a like special fusion item. Yes. Okay. What does what does people talking about? Humans hate and kill each other, ruining the planet for their own desires. We're a complete failure as a species. Humans only think of themselves. Better that they be wiped from the Earth. Oh right, everyone's under his control right now. I forgot. They're pulling a twee-wee. Alright, stupid Cupid. <laughs> I, f I forgot that, um, the weapons are stronger than the guns. The weapons are very much stronger. So if, if things don't null physical, it is just a wash even more. I don't like that move. I don't like that move one bit. Okay, okay. Let me let me do this a little more strategically. Nanjo, please heal. And then, um, bumper, and then, yeah. God damn it, Ragey. Okay, now we should be fine. Why is Ragey dead? When we lose all the people, and then all of our, like, attack squares aren't covered, then it becomes really annoying. Okay. But, but progress. But very good progress. Out of the first three floors onto the next three. Floor four. What do we got? Okay. We got another save point. I feel like this has been the most amount of save points in one dungeon. And then there's another room, and then more stairs. Good. Oh, who? Hello. Who are you? Salome. Hmm. Are you weak to magic? Yes, indeed you are. Ah, 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 ah. Get out of here. Okay. What is in this room? More people, more boxes. 
Metal card, eh. Tanzanite, ooh. HP incense, okay. Probably should have given that to Maki. Eh, it's fine. What's the meaning of this? Everyone's spouting identical nonsense. How are you not tainted, my friend? Okay, blah, blah, blah. My head, it hurts. Okay. Well, that's why she's not weak to fire, because she uses it. Oh. They absorb dark, even though they're cupid. Huh. There we go. Okay. More stairs. The fifth... Fifth floor. Reggie, wake up. Okay. The fifth floor. What do we have here? I'm not sure what I'm looking at. Okay, so what I'm seeing is there's a drop-down point into the fourth floor, which I think is what we need to go to, but then there's also this weird mark that looks like a red arrow, which I don't know what that is. Is that a lever? What is that? I guess I'll see what it is, because there's one... Oh. It's on, it's on the map. Hmm. I guess I'll see what it is, since it's right near the, the drop point. Oh, Ganesh. Weird how he, he changed from yellow to blue. Wait, no, it's not, wait, is it? There's two, there's two elephant men. Persky. You are not either of them. Who are you? You are not Ganesh or Grimma Makala. How are there three elephant men? Oni Guruma. Hmm. You know, these weapons are probably pretty cool, but they're just not as good as the ones we have. Okay. So, down here. Uh -uh. Okay. I get what those are. Those are levers. Those are levers we have to pull. Skeleton. The boner. That is the advantage that guns have on weapons. They they hit more. They have a wider range. 
Okay. Yes. So you, you can see how on the map, that's meant to connect. But there is another lever which we have to pull, which I guess makes that open. God damn it! Die! You have a lot of health. Okay. Seeing as how kind of quick we're leveling up, I feel like getting to 99 wouldn't be that bad. So maybe I'll do it. Maybe. Alright. There's the lever. We pull the lever. Now we go back. What is... What is that? What is that? Virtue... And then we got a blue dragon instead, instead of the purple one. Guns, guns still work. It, they're just, they're just too good. They are just too good. All right. Now we're in here. And I don't know what this other lever lever does, but I guess we'll we'll pull it too. Because the drop off is right in the center. Not sure what this lever does, but I, you know, there hasn't been a lever we shouldn't have pulled yet. And now we drop down onto this part of the fourth floor. Oh, okay. That lever is probably a sneaky trick because down there is a way to drop down to the third floor. And that's for if you missed the lever. Okay. Um, there is a velvet room and a save point right here. Yeah, I guess let me hit that save point. Because we are, in fact, almost done here. The rest of the way is straightforward. We just go here, back on the fifth floor once again. And we have to go through this room Please, no more encounters. Why would you cast Fire Wall if you already absorb fire? Okay, what's in here? More scientists, okay. Uh, an amethyst. 
an opal. And the last thing... Nope, hang on. Get me back in there. The last thing... Nice. Well, there's raiding Deva Yuga. That is all the items. Poison. Poison? Uh... There we go. That is all the items. And our, our good scientist buddies have, have been taken. Damn. But we're almost there. We're almost free. Because the stairs are right here. And the sixth floor is very tiny. Now then. The, um... The floor here has markings. Red dots and purple dots. What do those mean? Oh, the tiles turn on and off. So we have to turn on all the ones in the, the middle. Uh, that's it. Okay. Bingo! Well, we're here. We are here. Men. What was in the room that was locked? We got all the items. I what? It 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 does not tell me what's in there. I guess that's for after. Hmm. Um. Okay. Yeah, I guess. I guess we're ready. We're we're ready to go in. Condori. Your ass is mine. We finally found you. You're not going anywhere this time. You guys are so aggravating. I won't let you get in my daddy's way. That's enough, Aki. Stay back. But daddy... Wait in the other room. I'll be with you soon. Okay, daddy. Stop causing all this pain. Turn everyone back to normal. Don't worry. I won't do anything further. What the hell's with you? Decided to beg for your life all of a sudden? What are you living for? Huh? People aren't strong enough to live without a goal. Everyone wants something. No matter how small the desire, it gives them the strength to carry on. But if every desire is fulfilled, what's left to strive for? When one's wishes have been granted, the only thing that awaits is a bottomless solitude, an eternal emptiness. Then wouldn't it be better if one chose not to ascend the stairs of desire? That way, one's dreams are kept alive. Hmm. I kept ascending that stair to destroy this worthless world, but it no longer matters. Right now, nothing is beyond my grasp. Ha! The winds of solitude and emptiness blow within me. Such is a god's lot. Mm. Boy, I allowed you to come here in order to ask you this. Why do you cling to life? Dumbass, how old are you? And you don't even know that yet? We're alive so we can do the best we can every second of every day. You're always so frickin' sulky. It's not good for you, man. 
Gotta look on the sunny side. Why else? To kill you and put an end to your filthy bloodline. Until I do that, I can't give my mother the happiness she deserves. You, boy. I haven't heard your answer yet. What are you living for? I... I, I don't know what this, um, this choice does. I'm gonna guess to find my reason is for the good ending, so I... I guess I'll do I don't really know. I don't really know. That's not it at all. Our reason for living? We may never understand it, but I still believe in myself. With or without a reason, I'm going to live a life I won't regret. Condori, just stop this. It's painful seeing you so far out on a limb. What? Surely you must know. The seat of power you've reached by using people is no divine throne. Deep down, you know none of it was your doing. You miserable... You're suffering. You despair at your inability to live any other way. Stop. The same goes for her wish to erase mankind. It stems from one's anxiety for the future. Silence! I want to risk it, but I can't. If only I could disappear. Did you think burdening all mankind with your fears would make them go away? <sighs> Why continue rationalizing your neurosis with these grandiose principles? No one knows the foolishness of that more than you. I cannot forgive your offenses against God. I'll cleanse you from this world. Heh, <laughs> looks like you're finally ready to throw down. Can you defeat me? Can you protect the things you claim are precious? For my mother and my friends, I'll kill you. Then prove it before God's throne! You won't get an easy death. Are you prepared for that? Shut up! That's our line! If what Nanjo said is true, there's still time. Stop this nonsense and bring back our town, our world! Ha! <laughs> you tell a god to condone nonsense? That too is a grave sin. A god commands and condemns. It does not lend an ear to the pleas of vermin. Spout that crap in hell. I'll send you straight there. Condori, we'll close the curtain on this farce, if that's what you wish. All right, here we are. The bastard himself. He is weak to, like, everything. He's weak to gun, technical, ice, wind, earth, electric, miracle. Why is one of his skills called Shibabu? What is that? Alright. And I'm also... I'm trying something here. Because there is a cheat, an achievement I saw. I gotta beat him with no one dying. Which... Nanjo's probably gonna have to be on healing duty then. Alright. So he resists fire. So I probably gotta switch personas. What does... I don't know what what effect blast is that what Xan is? He he resists blast. Okay. Um, Urbashi, Buffalo. Yeah, I guess I can I can go with that. All right, Maki. He absorbs curse, so can't use that. Actually, I forgot. Maki has Megidola.
He resists nuclear, the bastard. Janus? You got a miracle move. Okay. All right. Who else should Nanjo be on? Nanjo does not have a good one to choose. So yeah, I guess Nanjo's just going to be on healing duty. I'm going to hit him with a Tarunda. Mark. He resists weapons, but Earth? I can use Earth. I can use Earth. All right. And then Reiji. Miracle. Let's see how this does. When I did not turn animations back on. Okay. Whoa. Eternal black. Oh. Yeah, already, already. Okay. So now that everyone switched, Reggie, Bufula, Maki, Eternal White, Nanjo, Heal, Mark, Magnara. Reiji, Bright Judgment. So this should be our our loadout. Why is Nanjo so slow? I don't like that. Alright, let's just keep that going. Shibabu. What the hell is that? Bind? Oh no. Well, good thing Nanjo blocks it so we can still heal. Come on, gang. Uh. Uh. <laughs> okay, that's already, um... The first phase. You thought this man would only have one phase? No. I refuse to accept this. I'm supposed to have transcended man. Who am I? I am Takahisa Kondori, the man who transcended humanity. What the? Something's forcing itself into me. Oh. Foolish man who has gone astray. I shall give you the power you desire. No! Oh, that man's gone. He's gone, and out comes... What the... Holy shit! Have his body and soul been dominated by the persona? I am Kandori. God... Kondori. Okay, so now so now we have God Kandori. The the second phase. What the hell am I looking at? Also, if you didn't know Nar Nyarla Thotep, it was uh Kondori's persona, and it just um it just uh usurped him. Alright, now he's got a whole bunch of different stuff. Now he's weak to arrows, gun, rush, fire, nuclear, gravity, blast, and curse. Oh, now now he's weak to the exact opposite of what we, we just had. Okay. Hang on, if he's weak to guns. If he's weak to guns. I believe we just do this. Oh my, thank you, Nanjo. Thank you, Nanjo. Yeah, I believe we just, we just do this. No, 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 no. You, you stay on that. You stay on that. Oh, oh yes. Oh, oh yes. 
derangement voice? What the hell is that? What is what is derangement? Panic? Oh, it's confused. God damn it. Nanjo is my boy, though, and he's got it on lock. Maki, stay alive. I know you don't have that much health, but just stay alive. Did Mark just move positions by himself? It can do that? Ew. Okay. Oh, now Mark's moved into a position where he can't shoot, so I gotta bring him back. Okay. And then Mark... Actually, do you have a skill you can use? No, you don't. Actually, here we go. I can use one of these. Because we have quite a bit of these. What can I use? I'll just go with a... Go with a Moragion. And then, uh, yeah, just keep going. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay. There we go. Now he's back. Okay. Mark is now back, so that'll add to the damage. Someone's going to have to replenish Nanjo's SP, I believe. But we'll we'll see. Love the crit, love the crit, keep doing it. Maziodine, oh my god. Keep doing crits, keep doing them. Doesn't matter what move you do, we still live and the Nanjo heals. There we go, the fall of a demigod. And? Oh, I guess we... Guess we'll get the, uh... The other one after this. Faceless Mask. What is Faceless Mask? There we go. We have beaten Kondori, and we did it with no one dying. Very nice indeed. Now what's gonna happen? To be defeated so. You are absolutely correct, young Nanjo. This was the only way I knew. Maybe I summoned you here because I wanted to hear someone say it. <laughs> I must seem a fool, but I feel remarkably content. Where is the real Maki? Ah, you've solved the mystery of the two worlds. I'm not surprised. Kay, 
What do you mean? You and the people of your world were mere figments of a certain imagination. Maki Sonomura's. Huh? What are you saying? What does that mean? You're... probably the idealized self of the Maki Sonomura we know. And the town you live in is the world inside Maki Sonomura's heart. Am I correct, Kondori? Yes. Not only her. Mai and Aki are also shadows within Maki Sonomura's heart. Wow. Who could have guessed Mai and Aki were part of Maki? Wow. All of you are nothing more than aspects of her. No. That's not... Maki. Mai. Aki. Simple anagrams. Maki must have conceived of her own paradise in her heart. One modeled off her memories of Mikage until the day she was hospitalized. No way. And there was no police station or hospital because... They have no place in paradise. She only had room for what was useful. It's a common sentiment. Shisato and Yosuke were no doubt drawn in by Maki's unconscious desires. When it came to her crush and her best friend, she wanted the genuine article. The trial run of the Davis system succeeded roughly a month ago, but she was linked to the system even before then. Her wavelength must have synchronized with the systems. Once she had internalized the power to interfere with the dimensions, the paradise within her heart seems to have grown beyond our imaginations. And you came into contact with Mai, caretaker of that paradise. Mai. No. That Maki was isolated. She had her role for the ideal Maki. To provide the world she always wanted as comfort for Maki in the real world. You know the rest. You're lying. None of that makes sense. Then go. Meet your true self. She is here, in this castle. But I'm me. This... this is too much. Oh no. Maki! Oh no. Are you going after her? You're the only one who can save her, you know? Maki Sonomura. She needs to discover her true self. If she doesn't, she'll share my fate. Go to her. Don't let her go down that lonely path. What a pitiful man. Reggie, we gotta look for Maki. And there's the man who transcended humanity. Okay, that's the one for just regularly beating him. Okay, uh, uh, I, I guess, I guess we go to her. I guess we, we go to her. And of course, there's only one place she can be. You know what it is. It's the, uh, it's the one room we couldn't go in. Also, I don't feel like battling right now because we are missing a party member. Oh, good lord. Okay, I'll just meet you when we get there. Luckily, that drop point puts us right in front of it. And also, our scientist buddies are, are good now. Great. But, seeing as the choices we've made, I don't see this conversation going well. Oh. This... This can't be. You idiot! Why did you kill Daddy? Don't you know what you did? <laughs> this is me? No. I made everyone suffer? You killed the only one the real me could rely on. No one will save us now. It's all over. There's three Makis. Are they all her? Maki! No. Don't come near me. Don't look at me. Calm down, Maki. This has to be some kind of mistake, right? Stop saying that. That's a lie. This is me, I can tell. 
I messed up the town and made everyone suffer. I did that. Don't take it so hard. He was using you. No, that's not it. Please don't be nice to me. I understand everything now. I was jealous of everyone. Wearing cute clothes, walking around town, gossiping about each other's boyfriends, laughing and joking. I envied everyone who went to school and had fun with their friends. I wished that school and the town would all be swallowed up. Maki. Even if I wanted to do something about it, I couldn't. I cried and cried. My jealousy and loathing grew. I made up an ideal town to comfort myself. Now do you understand? I'm hopeless. I don't deserve to live. <laughs> you? It's all over for you, too. Kondori is gone. Eruser Tissamum. No! No! Oh. Now this quiet town will go back to how it was. Thank you, mister. You're... you're going to keep living there? Yes. If I don't, I'll feel sorry for myself. You're going back, too. I want you to keep acting as my ideal self. No! I don't want to go back there! Eruser Tizamum. No! Reggie! Oh. Hmm. You like this boy now. Okay. I'll make him, too. It's easy. Bye-bye, mister. Oh, no. Maki! Maki! Through the world's eyes were on Mikage-cho after the incident, Normalcy eventually returned to the town. Despite the heave media attention on Sebek and Kondori, the identities of the students central to the incident remained hidden. As time passed, people seemed to try their hardest to forget the events that transpired. Time marched ever on. As if driven by something, or as if pursued by their repressed selves, the people lived their lives, day in, day out. Damn. Yeah, that is indeed a bad ending. Maki stuck in the uh, in the in the in the world. Party Maki and real Maki too. Oh no. And we couldn't even go there cuz they broke the mirror. I bet I mean we we beat Kondori, you know? We beat him, we saved all the people. But I have a feeling our friends didn't, uh, didn't take to the situation too well. I don't think any of them are happy. So, so, so yeah. But I mean, it could, it could be worse, you know? Things have just gone back to normal, like they, they were at the beginning of the game. But our knowledge, our knowledge is now tainted, and things are not good. Things will never be good again. But that's why this is the bad ending. And Persona has multiple endings. So, we're not gonna focus on this bullshit. We're not gonna focus on the doom and gloom. 
because that's not what really happened. No. No, it's not. We saved that nurse in the hospital. We, we got the compact without having to fight Mr. Bear. We saved Maki's mother without having to fight her. And we know exactly what our reason for living is. So we're not gonna take this shit lying down. We're gonna march right back up there, beat Condori again, and we're gonna... We're gonna tell Maki exactly how it is, and have her come to her senses. But... That's all gonna be next time. Cogito ergo sum. I don't know what that means, but it's it's a pretty cool Latin Latin quote by Rene Descartes. Hmm. All right. Come on, and uh, uh, come on, and fade. To the depths of Mikage Ruins, the seal on the door to B8 has been lifted. Challenge the deepest reaches of the ruins. You get the post-game dungeon with the bad ending? Why? Why? Hmm. I needed to, there's there's the trophy. It's all over. It's all over. But yeah, I I needed to I needed to to get to the title screen for the the trophy to pop. But there we go. There's the bad ending. No more bullshit. We're, we're gonna beat the game now. We're gonna... We're gonna have good stuff happen. To all our friends and us as well. Alright. And with that... I will end it... There. I've been Player One. And we'll see you next time. When the actual stuff happens. All right, bye-bye.